finally, after a hair-raising three-hour journey, we eventually reach Bangladesh's capital, Dhaka. Out of the frying pan, into the fire. Here comes Dhaka. Dhaka is one of the world's fastest growing and most populated cities, with some 45,000 people per square mile. This city is chaotic, honestly. And there are rickshaws on the roads, on the side streets, all over the place. The Rickshaw Express. And the best way to get to the Kawan Bazaar, the largest market in Bangladesh. Now, you've got to think, with the massive population that Dakar has, you are going to need a big market to be able to supply the demand. It's a cavernous hive of activity, jam-packed full of fresh ingredients. The quality of the produce in here is incredible. Look at this place. I mean, there's about three or four different varieties of turmeric in here. Incredible chilies. Very nice, very nice. All these sacks here, rice. Right up to the ceiling and about 20 stalls deep. This is good for pilau. Uh, this is specially birani pilau. Do you know birani? Yeah, I know biryani. Biryani. Yeah. biryani. I know biryani, I know pilau. This yeah. is what you use? Yeah. Interesting. I've walked for about 50 meters now, flanked left and right by just limes. Mountains of the highest quality ginger. And over there, mountains of the highest quality garlic. There is a reason for these fans being here, and it's to blow the, the skin that comes off the onions, to blow it away, so you don't get piles and piles and piles of skin on your stand. Presentation is everything. Eventually, I find the fish section. If you ever doubted whether or not Bangladesh were a fish-loving nation, come here. Look at these. This is the same type of catfish that I hauled out of the pond back at Mr. Baten's fish farm. Got carp and snakehead here as well. And then there's the wild fish. All of this here is freshwater fish. You have freshwater prawns over here. And this is a fish called pomfret, which is an ocean fish. And that is really good to eat. I mean, that is like top 10 fish in the world for me to eat. Where I'm headed to next is where the river meets the ocean in a big brackish mangrove environment. We're gonna catch wild saltwater species. 